2008, the IRS studied a, issued a commission to study ROBs to help people understand how to, how to do them and uh, pros and cons, what to do and what not to do. Because there are many promoters of ROBs programs, and ROBs really allows a person to use their retirement dollars and fund a new business that they're actually going to run, work in, and earn a, earn a salary without going through a taxable distribution and an early taxable uh, under 59 and a half penalty tax. But what a ROBS program does is the client has to create a new C corporation, a brand new company from scratch. Then we will create a 401k plan for the new corporation. So you felt the client's old retirement dollars can be shifted to the new 401k plan and the 401k plan can buy shares in the new corporation. That is bare bones how a ROBS work. There are many different ways to do what I just said. Um, some are a little bit, uh, less defensible in IRS tax court than others. We have a very experienced, 30 year experienced plan administrator who will take our clients that want to do this, hold them by the hand and design the plan to make it as defensible as we can because one thing we can't tell them, it's not like an IRA or 401k. Every one of these will be looked at by the IRS. But if you do it right, and, and follow the rules, it's a great way to fund a business and you become your own boss and entrepreneur and you get to use your 401k dollars and you get to add to it as your business grows. If you have employees, if you hire this new business, they can contribute to the plan. There's just a lot of benefits if the ROBS program is done correctly and we're pretty experienced in doing that.